our father, who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done. Montana, 1880. My name is Colton White. My father and I hunt game for the steamboat to travel on the Missouri. Not a bad living if you can stand your old man kicking you every morning at dawn. Bite some jerky and collect your gear. Time to earn our pay. Come on. The more game we bag, the more we get paid. Let's get moving. Right behind you, Paul. Elk bed. I can smell them. Tracks are fresh. Come on. This way. There he is. Quail. Promised the cook I'd bring him some. Shoot when I flush him out. Draw your weapon. Wait here while I stir up them birds. You're gonna need at least three. Nice shot. I've got another. Got him. Well, I'll be damned. You did it. Hey, you're pretty good with that iron. See if you can take down the next group with your quick draw. That was too easy. I try to get all these. What's next? We're burning daylight. Let's go hunt us some elk. You hear that, boy? Whoa. You're looking real sharp. Mangy bastards. Okay, back to business. Follow close. And keep quiet. Don't fall off the ledge. You spook the herd. All right, you made it. Remember, don't fall off. Pull out your rifle, Cole. Come here. Mm -hmm. 
Use your sights to get a closer look. We're gonna need to bag at least two of these out. You're getting the hang of it. Good. All right, you got him. That'll be enough. Come on, let's go collect our kills. Careful on the way down, so you don't hurt yourself. Whoa! Come on, Carl, that's our game. You hear that, boy? Wolves. Get ready. Ha! You show them. God damn it! We gotta get them off our kill. <laughs> nice work. That's it. Here's your knife. Get in close. Shit, there's more over here. Get in the Make sure every last wolf in the area is dead. That seems to be the last of them. Sure took your sweet time. I was just admiring your rifle. <clears throat> Another tick or two and you'd be putting me to bed with a pick and shovel. You're too damn ornery to die. Well, it prides me to see it's rubbed off on you plenty. Always remember, son, in this world, pure cussedness will carry you farther than a Comanche's pony. Ah, uh, here's our payday. Wait here. Be back in a moment. Did you bring it? Where is it? In the safe? Blessed you with the talent of a marksman. I do all right, preacher. I'll rest easy tonight, knowing one so capable as you is among us. A good day to you, sir. If that's a man of the cloth, then I'm the king of Siam. Hmm. Keep an eye on him. I'm going to have a word with the pilot. Tell me where it is you want, hold, and you will save the lives of everyone on this boat. They will be done. Kill them all and find the 
item! Something's wrong. The steamer's slowing down. They jammed the rear wheel. Get them back and free up that wheel. Come on, check up. Kill everyone on this shit. White men turn savages. Where are they from? up the wheel. Thank heavens. We're moving again. Uh, uh, we got keelboats coming up ahead. Someone get to that cannon on the keelboat tied to it. Get on that keelboat cannon and blast those boats. Don't let those keelboats get too close. on the north side. You up more. Fine shoot, Cole. Got some left in me. They just keep coming. They're coming from both sides. I'm a hit. Help me out, Cole.
too late. That preacher killed it. Son of a bitch is leading the ambush. Son, listen close, because there ain't much time. I've done my best to raise you right, but all your life I've been lying to you. The boilers are gonna blow. Quick, take this. That's a token for the Alhambra, the cat house in Dodge City. Go there and ask for Jenny. I ain't leaving you, Pa. God damn it, that's what I'm trying to tell you. I ain't your father. Now, go! Oh. Oh. Covered, sir. You failed me? No, sir. The whore had it stowed inside the safe and it sank to the bottom of the river. Failure was not an option. The price must be paid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that back. You meant no harm, friend. I thought for certain you were dead. I, I kicked you three times. Who are you? Friends call me Honest Tom. I need to get upriver. The steamboat's been ambushed. The Morning Star? Hell, it was three days ago. Were you aboard? <laughs> oh, hate to tell you, friend, but no one survived. Renegades got them all. Scalped every man, woman, and child. Bloody savages. Ned, where's Dodge City from here? Through the pass, about a day's ride to the ferry boat. That horse for sale? In a hurry, huh? I don't blame you. If I had me a token to the Alhambra, I'd be in a hurry, too. You uh, look to be a sporting man. Care to wager? Go ahead, kid. Stick your toes in the stirrups. Uh, you have ridden before, have you not? All right, you ready, friend? Being honest as I am. I'll give you a chance to run around a bit before we wager. First, let's try some sprinting. Press the sprint button to spur your whole... Do it again. Notice that burst of speed to get it to start? Ain't that a kick in the ass? <laughs> Spurring too much can even kill your horse. Then he'll be real mad. <laughs> All right, let's see you attempt some jumps. Press it. Bill, and the horse will revive. Tiny neck. Do it again. Show me if you got the goods, kid. Any cuss worth his bridges ought to be able to whip me in a horse race. Now well, let's see how good you really are. Let's race. Face 
facing the same direction as me. Three laps round the meadow. Get ready to race. Ready? Go! <laughs> Well, kid, you win fair and square. Be kind to her, will you? I will. She's been a good animal. Thanks. Come on. God damn it, it took you long enough. So much for your name. You really think I'd give up my ride without a fight? Let's kill this bastard. He's got an Alhambra token on him.
You're lucky. This is my last run till further notice. The fugitive band of Apaches are on the warpath again. They cut the telegraph and destroyed the bridge leading out of Dodge. What's got them stirred up? New railroad between Dodge and Empire. Cuts through their land. Dodge City. Take the token to the Alhambra Saloon and ask for Jenny. That's what Ned said just before he died. Oh, and seeing as you're new to Dodge, thought I'd better warn you about the locals. Dodge can be a pretty rough place, so if you're going to start a fight, be prepared to finish it. Or plan on getting out of town until it blows over. I'm sure you'll be fine. Have a good one! Help you? I'm looking for Jenny. Hey, Jenny! Where'd you get this? A fella named Ned White gave me in. Told me to come here and ask for you. I remember Ned. He was real sweet on a girl that used to work here, Sadie. That's her picture above the bar. Sadie's dead. What? How do you know? Who are you? Ned was my father. He and Sadie were both killed on a steamboat up north. Come on upstairs. God damn it, girl! How long we gotta wait for you get a proper poke? Till I tell you. Now have another drink on me and I'll be with you shortly. He ain't getting a poke before uh, us. Let go of me! Not till I'm done with you, bitch! Come on! Uh, yeah! Uh, yeah! Uh, yeah! Uh, yeah! Uh, woo! Yeah! Stop him! His
Come over here. Better show you this now before the rest of the Red Hands show up. It's all yours. The night before she left, Sadie begged me to keep it safe till Ned came for it. Poor girl was in love with him, I think. Ned never cared much for six guns. Rifle and tomahawk were his choosing. Where'd Sadie go from here? Empire, New Mexico. A new sporting house wanted her for the main attraction, but she ran off a short time after she got there. Huh, you know why? No, but maybe I'll find out. As soon as the roads open, I'm going to Empire to replace her. Get back! Burn it to the ground! That bastard killed my brother! He's got his gang downstairs, trying to set fire to the place. See him! Please, God. No way! Turn it off! Ah. Where you think you're going? Go, go! Put the torch on! Ah. Come on, faster! Ah. I'm done, boys! You Hell stop the firebox from starting more. Son of a bitch! this thing if you got the balls
Hell of a shot, kid. Bet he was dead before he hit the ground. Huh. You gonna arrest me? Hell no. I'm gonna hire you. I'm Patrick Denton, city marshal. Where you been, Pat? All hell's broken loose here. Huh? Out at the bridge. Huh? Patches are making things plenty hot out there. Listen, I could use a dead shot like you to protect the Chinaman. How about it? He's coming back inside with me. Oh, lucky him. Well, if you change your mind, kid, come on out to the bridge west of town. Damn Peckerwood. Jenny, can you keep a secret? I'm a book of secrets, honey. I was on that steamboat. A murdering preacher led the attack. I saw him kill Sadie. <gasps> a preacher? About a week ago, a reverend named Reed showed up here looking for Sadie. Did he say where he was from? He said he'd come from Empire. Then I'm going there with you. I know the mayor of Empire. His name's Hoodoo Brown. If anyone can help you find that preacher, it'll be him. Then I better get out to that bridge, help that marshal get the road open. <laughs> Keep the change. Reed, that son of a bitch is gonna pay. Just as soon as I get to Empire City. You, you look like the adventuring stork, but are you daredevil enough to ride for the Pony Express? Well, if you want the work, come see me. I'm around. You might also try my brother Daryl in Empire. The pay's real good. <laughs> if and y'all stay alive long enough to spend it. <laughs> you know, I'm just kidding you. Okay, gonna start you off easy. Go lend tiny tubs a hand. Poor fella so big, he can't walk from one end of town to the other. I declare, I am simply famished. If I don't procure some comestibles post haste, I shall surely perish. I do believe the shopkeep has everything I need. Them's a lot of vittles. You sure they'll fit in your saddlebags? Heavens! You barely made it here in time. Why, a moment longer and I'd be crestfallen. Wanted George Whiskers Mahoney for the wanton murder of an Empire barber following a bad beard trim. Known to be found gambling in the Alhambra Saloon.
Well, people you die. listen. I'm the boss, and I say this bridge to... has got to. This over. the road to Empire? Huh? Well, yeah. Till Quick Killer shut it down. He and his band have been keeping things so hot, even the Irish won't work anymore. Only the damn coolies are willing. Where do you want me? On the far end of the bridge, son. Chinamen got one last section to go, and I don't want them stopped again. Kid, keep an eye peeled. Indians made off with a box of TNT last night. They're aiming to use it, I'm sure. Kid, that's a load off my mind. <laughs> now you cover the road and let the Chinamen do the rest. Easy for you to say. Chuba! Let's go!
Here come the Indians. Protect the workers. Now they're coming afoot from the far shore. They got rafts and are crossing the river. Watch it. shooting, kid. Now let's get up top and finish this bridge. Damn, nice. Damn, kid. That was some kind of shooting. Oh, quick killer's gonna think twice before he tries something again. <laughs> Damn it, the devil won't give up! Ah! Ah! I'll take care of this. Use your quick draw to take care of the fire arrow.
thanks to you, this bridge will be open lickety-split, and you and Jenny can be on your way. I'd stage route, right, I'll still be crawling with Apaches. How many men you got coming with us? Just two, driver and shotgun messenger. That ain't enough. That's all you got. Apaches got everyone else too damn scared. likely to meet Apaches along the way. If they get the upper hand, I promise you'll put a bullet in my head before they have their fun. Get those wheels rolling, cop! Come on, get them going! Back to the barricade.
pin's busted. I can fix it, but it'll take some time. I'll buy you some with this. Use your shot. Don't let them near my coach. Damn it, they just keep coming. Keep them off me. Ooh. All set. Come up! Now shoot that barrel, and let's get the hell out of here. Shoot them powder kegs to blast us a path. Look sharp now! Kill as many as you can! Ah! 
Thank God you're here. The damn Apaches cut the telegraph wires, and I was beginning to fear for the worst. We were ambushed in the Badlands. None of your precious parts was damaged, I hope. You know how our customers hate bruised fruit. <laughs> <sighs> I'm in one piece, <clears throat> thanks to Colton here. He left more than a few Apaches dead in their tracks. Son, you've done the town of Empire a great service. I'm Mayor Hoodoo Brown. Should you ever need any assistance, please don't hesitate to ask. I am looking for someone. I told him you would help. Of course, of course. Listen, why don't you have a look around town, then come and see me inside, and we'll have ourselves a proper sit-down. Now, let's get you freshened up. To hell with that line rag! Goddamn reprobates have no respect for law and order! The Miller gang is riding hard towards Empire. And we don't take kindly to rabble-rousing migrants around here. Join my deputy in East Empire and take them out. Mangy bastards! I hear some smallpox vaccines have been taken. Whether it's Indians or renegades, I don't care. Get that stuff back to me, safe and sound.
Looking for hoodoo, I'd wager. This way. Come on in, kid. We were just about to hold our usual confabulation before the night shift begins. I see Rudabaugh has already made your acquaintance. This is J.J. Webb, my other right-hand man. Now tell us about this fellow you're looking for. Jenny said something about him being a jack preacher. Reed's his name, Josiah Reed. What do you want with him? It's a personal matter. Hmm, I see. Tell you what. I could use a crack shot like you. You put this on, and I'll see if I can find some information on that scalawag Reed. When that skunk shows his face again, you'll have the law on your side. What do you say? I hereby deputize you, Constable. Empire Police Department. Spotted Chavez, he's Chavez in town. What's going on? Key player among the resistance is in town. If you boys can nab him, it'll be a big step toward restoring some law and order here. Get going. No time to waste. Get your ass in the saddle and try to keep up. Gotcha. There he is. Keep your eyes peeled for anything suspicious. Where the hell you going? I said follow us. Check out the saloon. Good one, this Where's Chavez? He just left. Before that, he was talking to them two. Well, I don't know, man. This, this here problem's getting pretty big. If the Apaches don't start pulling this thing together, I don't know what we're gonna do. Hills. Right over. Look, see. They're coming in fast. Oh, right. on the We're covered. Stand your ground. Take cover. Get up the back. They're coming in from all over. Don't kill us. Let us go. Guess we missed Chavez. Say a word, we swear. Let's go! Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? They were unarmed. Bullshit. As Gracer was pulling a gun. Didn't you see it? I saw it clear as day. You better get wise, kid, if you want to stay alive. You shot those folks in cold blood. I'm taking you to Hoodoo. You dumb rube. Who do you think we take orders from? Hoodoo's been playing you and your little whore like a fiddle. Keep your hands up. 
What are you gonna do? Shoot us in cold blood? Yeah, Rube. Who's the murderer then? <laughs> Howdy, stranger. I hear you're looking for some extra work. Well, you're in luck. I need to get my cattle back to their pens. Reckon I'll need to show you how to herd first, eh? Gamble to the barn, pick a horse, mount up. Get a cow going, right up next to it. The key to running cattle is to stay behind them. They do their best to get away from you. And you can use that instinct to drive them. If you are on their left, they go right. If you're on their right, they go left. Now get these calves into their pen so I can judge your technique. Well done. All right, let's meet the rest of the herd. Follow me! running when they get close enough. Once you have the herd together, the steer knows where to go. Follow the herd to the corral. Bring back any cows that get spooked or run off.
Hey, kid. I'm nothing but your damn puppet. Is that what you think? Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, kid. Who told you such a thing? Webb and Rudabaugh, before I plugged them both. They're dead? Just like you're gonna be. Kid, listen to me. That preacher you're looking for is in that room right now with Jenny. She lured him there. I was just coming to get you. Liar. <coughs> Jenny! You the one from the steamboat? <laughs> yes. Bring him to me. I had to waste a perfectly good whore to get to the truth about you. Bastard! I could hardly believe it when she told me. Ned White, still alive after all those years. <laughs> now he's as dead as you're gonna be. <laughs> Hang him in the morning for the murder of the girl. This old hoodoo's got the touch of a blacksmith, don't he? What did you do? Torched his printing press. You saw it. A subtle act of protest to silence the mouth of tyranny. That's soapy. He's educated. How come he's in there? It's a little game we play. They lock me up, and I find a way out. And you, my good man? How did you incur the mayor's disfavor? I killed Webb and Rudabaugh. Gonna kill Hoodoo, too, and a certain Jack Preacher, and that one-eyed pig they work for. Thomas Magruder. Railroad man. He's taken over the territory. Us and the Apaches are the only ones fighting back. Count me in, too. As soon as we find a way out of here. If we're gonna get out of here tonight, that deputy's gotta die. See if you can grab him when he gets close to the bars. Oh, ah. Lacey from the H.J. sent over some chicken for your last meal. But I'm afraid there isn't much left. <laughs> Besides, you don't want to shit yourself when you swing from that tree tomorrow, do you? <laughs> I heard you was a little sneak that done cracked up. Give me the keys or you'll be slipping on your own guts. I don't got them, I swear. Hoodoo took them for safekeeping. So, so killing me won't do no good, you see? You'll still swing tomorrow. If you grab that badge he so enjoys degrading, you can use its pin to pick the cell lock. I'll tell you how, if you promise to free me as well. Know what that makes you, partner? Hell! This human lockbox they got me in is gonna be a little tougher. I'm afraid you're probably gonna have to blast me out of here if you hold fair to our deal. I'll hold fair. Let me stash some horses beneath the bridge, then I'll scrounge out back of the powder shop for something to blast you out. I ain't in much shape to fight, but if you get me out of here, I gotta hide out up in the mountains. Reckon that makes us partners, Soapy. Hope you're right about picking this lock. Now just give it to Jimmy, and she ought to turn loose. <laughs> Grab your gear before you head out, kid. It's on the deputy's desk. You'll do yourself a favor if you can stay out of sight. Try and bring these horses back real quiet-like.
There once was a Dodge City maid who was a whore by trade. For a buck at a whack, she'd lie on her back and let the cowboys have a poke at her crack. One day, to her surprise, her belly began to rise. Her slit gave a grunt, and out jumped a run with his balls between his eyes. Oh, the moon shines tonight on dear old Jenny. As she lays asleep, and a shadow comes creeping. That's one. We still need two more. One morning I was bailiff, and I escort this petty rustler into the courtroom. And Hoodoo's not there yet. Funk figures himself a real badass, right? There he is! Ha! up on Mercado Pass. Well, years back, a man named Booker lived up there with his injun wife and half-wit son. Hey, well, they kept to themselves mostly, but uh, one night I was in the saloon when his wife stumbles in. She, she's all bloody and crazy with fear. Seems her husband had killed their son and tried to kill her too. And this is why. See, whenever folks was traveling by, Booker'd invite them in for supper. And soon as they'd sit at the table, he'd murder them with an axe and he'd throw their bodies in the cellar. This, this, this carried on for some time. Well, once a Ute Injun come by to visit his wife and whack! When his next intended victim happened to ask, Hey, you ever get any Indians around here? Well, the half-wit son replied, you can't you smell the one Papa just put in the cellar? Well, Booker went berserk, killed the boy and the visitor before his wife made her escape. Well, Posse got up there right quick, but Booker had vanished. When they looked in the cellar, they found more bones than you find in Boot Hill. You might want to create a distraction before you get near that powder shop. Why don't you fire up the livery with a whiskey bomb? That ought to give Hoodoo's men something to do while we get the hell out of here. Maybe a fire at the livery will draw folks' attention. Charge too strong. 
It was nice knowing you, Soap. Gentlemen, I regret to say this is where I fall. The calmer climbs of dear old Dodge are calling. So long, Soap. I wish you well. Come on, kid, move your ass. They'll be out looking for us soon. I'm taking you to meet Clay Allison. Clay and Magruder go way back. Magruder's been strong-arming the whole territory looking for something, but no one knows what he's after. Don't shoot, boys. It's Port. Port, it's good to see you. Uh, oh, how bad they treat you. They busted me up pretty good, but I didn't squawk none. This here's the fella who sprung me. Port, are you blind? This is one of Hoodoo's boys. Search him. We saw them shaking hands in front of the hotel. No, Clay. He's all right. He killed Webb and Rudabaugh. What the hell is this? You know this man? That's my father, Ned White. Bullshit! I served with Ned in the war. He was killed in action ten years ago. You're mistaken, friend. Ned and I have been working the Rockies since I was a cub. Ned was murdered just a few weeks ago. Clay? He's after Thomas Magruder, just like us. I tracked the man behind Ned's death to Empire. Turns out he was working for Thomas Magruder. Ah, oh, want to get Magruder, do you? And every bastard on his payroll. Welcome to the Resistance. You can bet they've turned Empire into a fortress since your escape, but there may be a way in yet. Magruder sent a Gatling gun from Dodge on a train, where it's already out there laying the trap. Well, uh. Come on, let's go. Get on that horse and follow me. Try to keep up.
Hey, Clay! Just in time. Go. can you give me a hand with these powder kegs? As I unload these TNT barrels, do me a favor and move them into position by those loose rocks over there. Oh, and be careful with these barrels. They're not very stable, so don't be throwing them around. We need all four of them to call the rock slide. Position the barrels from above. Just place them around those rocks and listen for his word. That'll do. That's good. From up here, it'll be easy to shoot that TNT right as the train enters the canyon. Wait! Stop making chop and the boys thought they could take the train and dodge. But it was a trap. They're getting slaughtered. Take out Hoodoo's men on the train. Yes, yes, sir. You don't know how much longer we could have held them. Damn, they brought in reinforcements. Last barrel down there while I finish moving the ammo up the hill. Perfect. Hold your fire until the train gets into the canyon. Great. Now get up here onto the ledge so you can shoot the barrels before the train passes.
resistors. What happened? Uh, what, what happened? Oh, oh. Uh. You better have a look at this. Looks like you aren't the only ones being driven off your land. Bet you Magruder's using them for slaves. Get him out of there! They want water. Bring up some canteens. Ah, oh, shit. Di shi ene at e. Then take them home. In de slago na sin sed na di tin be ka. Now I've set many free. Where did you learn Apache? I'm not sure. It's like I could understand what he was saying, but I couldn't quite speak it. Ah. Better get back to the hideout and plan our strike. See the boys cut loose, huh? Maybe their last time before Magruder comes knocking. When I was face to face with that one-eyed bastard, he said he knew Nid. Is that true? Kid, Magruder was our commanding officer in the war. You're kidding me. What happened, Clay? Tell me. It was late 64. The Confederacy was desperate. Magruder had convinced Richmond to send us on a secret mission he thought could turn the tide of the war. Find Kivera, an ancient city of gold. It was rumored a white man in the area had been to the lost city. Ned led us to him. Dr. Campbell, I presume. Major Magruder, Texas Mounted Rifles. You're in the wrong place if you're hunting Federals, Major. I'm not hunting Federals, Doctor. Corporal Allison! Where is the cross? I don't know what you're talking about. What's he saying? He says one day you will find what you seek, and that day will be your last. Jesus, Tom! I haven't time for games, Doctor. Stop it, Tom. I never agreed to this. Count it! Long last. You son of a bitch! That cross is no good to you! I will not be denied! Can 
I stood up like Ned. The greeter might be in hell instead of back here doing his devilish work. You mean he's still after Corvera? The war ended, but his mission didn't. It's his holy grail. Clay, right before he died, Ned told me he wasn't my real father. You know anything about that? No, kid, I don't. Except that Ned was full of surprise. Ray! It's Magruder's militia. At least 20 men on horseback. Go. I'm on the Gatlin gun. Take this sharpshooter. It's done well by me. You and Chava stay up top. I'll be on the Gatlin gun below you. Vamos, Colton, pronto! I have my eyes on you, boy. Bingo! The damn thing's jammed! I'm gonna try and fix it. Stop! Give me some. Up there! Get your ass over here! Uh. You stay here and hold the fort. You're gonna see if they're in the foothills yet. Let's ride! Here! needs to talk to you. There he is. Did you see that cannon out there? If they finish getting that thing ready. It's already up. What are we gonna do? Be He's tough. Right There's here. plenty of fight left. Yeah. Keep your head yeah. down.
captured Clay, up on the ridge. They're taking him to Empire. It's over now. We're licked. Bullshit. Now we got a howitzer and a Gatling gun. Let's put them to use. It's no good, kid. They know where we are now. We'll be back tomorrow with twice a man. Then let's do what they don't expect. Attack. God damn, kid. You're as crazy as Clay. Jones and Decker have managed to sneak that howitzer down to the gulch just north of Empire and are waiting for us to join them for the attack. Let's move, kid. We're burning daylight. We hit them. We'll have to move through town pretty quickly. Once we've taken control of the Empire Bridge, head back to the Chinese Laundry and make your way into the Opium Den. From there, you ought to be able to find the secret tunnel that leads to Hoodoo's basement. I'm sure that's where they'll be keeping Clay. This is our only shot, kid. Hoodoo falls, or today we die. Jones is about to shit himself. Hoodoo's been pulling men into town all morning. He's got to have 30 men in town. Well, he's about to have 30 less. I'll move the cannon. You boys watch my back till I get her in position.
You'd better do the heavy gun. We can't afford to miss her. They'll be on us. and rescue Clay. Like some of your boys are attempting a rescue. The fools. <laughs> Come morning, I'll be hanging them all. I'll ask you again, Clay, and then we can go back to the pliers if that's what you prefer. How many men are attacking the town? Soon. Soon what? What's happening soon? Ah, right there. God damn, kid! What the hell's going on out there? We've come for you. And for Hoodoo. He's upstairs, Cole. I... I can't hold my gun. Never you mind, just follow that tunnel and I'll see you back at the hideout. Keep your wits cold and cut him slow. There's no way in hell he's getting in here. I'm coming, Hoodoo! Shoot the chandelier and burn the Whoa. son of a bitch! You've done your share of killing now, I'll be in mine. I got the upper hand, kid. You should know that by now. 
No more hiding behind Webb or Rudabar or any other thug with a badge. You messed with the wrong hoodoo, boy. Please, kid. Just let me go. I'll give you whatever you want. I want some answers. Let's start with a steamer. Why was it ambushed? Tell me, or I'll turn your brains into wallpaper. There was something on board. Something Magruder's whore had made off with. Sadie, what was it she took? I don't know. <laughs> Only the preacher knew. Magruder sent him to get it back at all costs. But the bitch stowed it in the pilot's safe. It sank when the boilers blew. It's under 10 feet of water. You can't get to it. When the snow is melting, this time of year, the water level's dropped a dozen feet or more. Thanks, hoodoo. You son of a bitch! Don't see many citizens rushing to your aid, Mr. Freak. Mayor. Why might that be? Sure makes a stink, don't he? We should stay, kid. Could use you when Magruder retaliates. Gotta get what's in that safe. Maybe that can help bring him down. Off to Dodge, first though. Dodge? What for? To pull a certain safe cracker out of retirement. Yeah! Denton, that you? What happened? Met with a mob of some of the more colorful citizens in town. What brings you back so soon, kid? Looking for an acquaintance. A little gambler named Soapy Jennings. You know him? Yeah, if you hurry, you might catch him. He's leaving? You might say that. Luke Short and his boys are lynching him at the gallows. Didn't care much for the way he shuffled cards. Come on. We need to get to the top of that water tower. They have Soapy held up in a building and we can't get to him. From the water tower, we should be able to hide and wait for them to bring him out.
Hey, kid, take this sharpshooter. It's dead on. Use your sniper rifle to shoot the rope around his neck. Don't shoot till they pull that trap door open. The rope has to be tight to split it. Wait, wait, that's it. Okay, let him have it, kid. Get those guys off. Whoa! Stay on Soapy. <laughs> He's getting away. Jesus. No more safes. No more stealing. They're coming from behind, Soapy. You ain't getting out of here. Here comes some more from behind the gallows. <laughs> Get that cheater before he gets away. Get that bastard. More guys from the east. <laughs> Got him. And the Lord. Here. You dumbass prairie trash! Rifleman, oh. oh. They're below. Uh. They're on the roof. Nowhere to go. Keep up. Uh. <laughs> Stupid ass puncher. God. My side. Priming, Come kid. closer. Oh, you and that Horses rifle. coming in from the east. You have to take out all the riders. There and protect soap from arriving. I'll stay behind and clean up the rest of this mess. Hurry! Get on down there and take out the horseman. Goodbye, Dodge, you lousy lit chucking bird. So long, Kansas, you flat pancake. Of your He's got me. Empire was my foundation. It was nothing but a piss hole for Mexicans. Until I put hoodoo in place. Where's the kid now? He was just in Dodge. Rumor is he rescued a safe cracker and fled north. He's going for the safe. Surely those renegades will retrieve it. Those traitors can't be trusted. You lost it. You go get it back. Now, go. I'm on my way, sir. Come on, follow me. Kid, I must say you're a sight for sore eyes. Save it, Soap. If I didn't need you for something, I'd let him finish the job. Ah, you're choking me up. Now what can I do for you? 
need you to open a safe, buddy. My stock and trade. Where is it? On the upper Missouri River. That's Blackfeet country, and I hear they're not too fond of white men. You can go back to that lynch mob if you like. I believe this calls for an expedition. <laughs> Shut up and ride. Soap, you watch the path. Shout up if you see anyone. get to the steamer wreck without showing ourselves to the fort. What's wrong with that? Don't want anyone to know we're here. Too late. Only two kinds of white men out here, soldiers and outlaws. And since I see no blue, you must be running from trouble or looking to stir some up. Till I figure which, you'll be my guest. Now let's have your guns. That's a fine rifle. How'd you come by it? Pried it from the cold, dead fingers of an Indian-loving fool. Sergeant Hollister, son of a bitch who commanded the Steamboat Massacre. Join the party. Take a squaw, even. Sarge, he's here. Let him in. But if I catch either of you trying to run, I'll slit you both wide open and make bowstrings of your guts. We're going down to the steamer. If anyone else approaches, take them out with the cannons. Let's go. Gruder's impatient. Holy shit, it's Reed. He must be after that safe, too. Come on, let's get out of this hill. I can't get us out of this one, kid. We're gonna have to find some help. Those ugly bastards will skin us alive if we're caught. We gotta be careful. Wish we had some help. Some of those braves might know a way out. Tika sexy matziti pa, niskini pa, a uknis o, koatsa skutsopa, anoma. Otaka Sitsi Piska Kimata Kitski Utoa Nisikze Putusoa Kiki Tapit Nitsopu Istapato Topa Anoma Sao Mitapi Ika Kimot Misokata Tsimisa Aniskisi Iini Ko Wanix Tsiato Akana Onupa I'm in your debt. Kisima nis topa, kitama nas nsini. Anoka, kita stamut zo, kita kenes, zakisipa. Anitsiit, itanes to pi, ki akitsi koma motopa. Guards are coming. 
It's not safe to leave yet. Those dumbass slackers still probably ain't finished. Jesus, they had all day. Wait. Stay here and watch the door. Make sure none of the prisoners get... Yes, sir. Remove the guard at the gate, so we can make our way out. Now, follow in my footsteps. If any of us are seen, they will kill us all. Wait. Okay, let's move. Kill him silently. You're dead me! We must go now. Stay close. What was that? Wait. Now, follow in my footsteps. Kill the guard and wait for us inside. Shoot him! Wait for us inside. He's burned up real good. Wait! How many scabs you got so far? Ten only. Now kill the enemy at the exit. We are almost there. Get him! Don't let him escape! There. The passage for their garbage is our way out. Make certain it is safe. I found him, sir. Ah, give me a sec to pick the lock. Music to my ears. Now I believe a hasty departure is in order. This cave leads to a place beyond the front of the fort. Step lightly and follow me out. Good spirits dwell here, for they have kept it hidden from the white devils. Almost out of here. From here on, we must not. Take up his bow and quiver. Take a look at these guns. Where'd you get them? Got them off that guy they caught snooping around early. Well, aren't you lucky? I gotta get back to my post. Use the bow to kill him in silence. Shut the door! Ah! My aim is true. <clears throat> ah, he got me! No oh, white devils have blocked our escape with a barricade! Use your bow to clear all enemies. Get a horse to break through the barricade.
Our village lies ahead, down this road. Ride on, we will meet you there. What's he saying now? He's telling a story of how I earned this necklace. Uh, it was a summer, a dozen years ago now. One morning I left camp to hunt on my own. I was skinning a small buck when a mountain lion attacked me from behind. Cat's claws peeled me like an apple before I managed to slit his throat. Ned found me, stitched me back together as best he could. For a week I hovered near death until a Blackfoot shaman brought me out of it. Ned said I come out of it different. Said I moved and stalked like a cougar now. So you owe the Blackfeet your life. Anok omatapapa tziyup. Napi koan omotsuki. There is a way to make you great again. Destroy the fort and the men inside. Bishkani inama wa siyup. Destroy them first. Then the fort will be vulnerable. I know how this can be done. Get to the canoes by the river. Entry to the fort.
Get up this ladder! I wonder how things are going now. Yeah, they need to hurry up, because it sounds like there's a battle going on. Drop that Arkansas too! We must... Leave me be. I've killed already. Smoke them. Four more! Four more! Inside the tower! have a
dynamite! Hollister Akik Sa Seo Mataksika Mutawa Iksukapi kina onamai kitayina ano ksistikoi otak espawanyo. Goodbye, my friend. Come on, so.
Soapy, time for you to go to work. <laughs> Here, kid, you can have the honors. Thank you for saving me the trouble of trying to open that myself. Now hand it over. Run! Spanish, 16th century. Writing's in Latin. It's incomplete. Another piece must fit here. I know where it is. Come on. The item. Did he get that too? Put a price on that kid's head. I don't care how much. I want every bounty hunter, every mercenary, every damn snake in the Western territories looking for that son of a bitch. No one is gonna stand in the way of my destiny. You understand? No one. Not the federal government, not the Apaches, and not some pissant kid with a stick gun. I've seen the other half of this cross. The Apache chief has it. If I can put the pieces together, then I can beat Magruder at his own game. I can't go through Dodge, not after the hanging. I'll catch up to you later. Meet me at the Apache.
Oh, Jesus. Pardon me. Let's go. You gonna leave them like that? They've been left as a warning. Cut them down, they might put us there instead. I think we might end up there anyway. She cut dots it is a jean hot don't want she need be ca I seek something you possess. Dawa chow ka ye naika he et e behitla he be. I don't understand. What are these things? Naj zihi be hit e she na jean bilt n jean ni et e. Get inside. Hide yourselves. Laji hati shi pikini ya haji akida ni itu a. Shetani ena his yet at e. She she, a hot old dish. She she in a hotting. Gobinina she she in a big discretion. Ba his ahi. Bechina na he nil. Stolen cross, meeting on the steamer. Ned was staging his revenge after all those years. He was trying to make things right, but Magruder caught on. He came here to unite the pieces of this cross. I never expected all this. There's a Latin phrase on each arm. It looks like some kind of map to... His zuki at ehi chegosh a... Follow me. We will meet my warriors, then I will show you the sight. One eye's lust to find Kivira has brought endless suffering to my people. Your father and mine learned much from each other. Their kinship was honored by our people. Those ruins are all that remain of your family's house. It was there that one eye slew your father. These men are my most trusted. They're trying to stop us from using the cross! Ugh. Oh shit! The ruined militia!
I must tend to my brother. You will have to go on without him. The site lies at the top of the mountain north of the water called Piper Lake. Cole, your destiny awaits. May you find what you seek. Let's get a move on, Cole. We got no time to waste. Yeah, this scrape ain't nothing. Why, one time, I was forced to make a rather abrupt departure from the Big Wheel Hotel in St. Louis. I was emptying the copper of a particularly rich industrial list when I was discovered by his mistress. Let out a scream that would deafen a cannoneer. <laughs> and no time the house detective arrived, leaving me no choice but to escape via the waste chute leading from the lady's water closet. and I needed when I finally emerged from that cesspit two days later. And my nickname. You sure got a leaky mouth, so. Looks like Magruder's already found it. It can't be that easy. He only had half the cross. Hmm. From God's altar... Hmm. Looks like... Twixt the tears of God... And the spires of heaven... When sun, sun and, moon and moon meet... Dusk. Behold his kingdom. There. They missed the mark. It's above the mine, not below. Huh? Get up there below! Uh, kid, get down! Show me the location, or shall I continue? No way. Dutchie, 
Wait, wait! It's there! There! That's impossible. I've sunk shafts all over that sector. You gotta dig up, you damn fool! It's above you! Of course. Get up. Up. <laughs> Dutchie! Get me back to that mine. Then take your train to find a kid. And ask for this little sneak. You son of a bitch! Told him. Told Magruder where it is. I had to. He was gonna blow them all off. I'm sorry. Can you move? <clears throat> On the other side of this hill, many wounds, and his warriors are gathering with Clay Allison and his men. Tell him to meet me back here at dawn. Where are you going? You want your fingers back, don't you? Side out looking for a Corvero when all along the lost city was right over his head. I've got to beat that bastard to it. The men are waiting in front of Magruder's mind, but. The doors are solid steel. I still don't know how we're getting in. You're riding on it. Better help me stoke this fire, because we're going to need a lot more speed. You lost your damn mind, kid. Oh. Welcome aboard the Kill Magruder Express. Next stop, end of the line.
Cannon.
turntable's got to be spun around! Turn that switch to unlock the turntable! Help me cover my allies while they spin the turntable! Track is set. Here. Let's roll Get a cannon throw. My whole life, I've been searching for this. Has it been worth all the bloodshed? 
How can you ask a question like that when your eyes are feasting on such magnificence? I don't see anything magnificent. Just a fat, one-eyed bastard whose greed has no boundary. <laughs> that sounds like Ned talking. No, this is Ned talking. Ah! <clears throat> Welcome to my domain, kid. And your final rescue. You're just like your father. Ned never had a stomach for combat, a weak-willed Indian-loving fool.
Shoot you in the teeth. That would be too kind. Reckon instead I'll take my knife and whittle you some like you did Soapy. Then slit your throat like you did Jenny. Or maybe I'll take this cross and jam it in your good eye and watch you twitch. None of that'll bring back my ma and pa. Or all those villagers you massacred. Nor Ned raised me as his own. Oh, did you hear that? Did you hear that? So long, Major. Give the devil my regards. Get back here, you can't leave me like this! <laughs>